What's up, y'all? How y'all doing? Back for part two. <laughs> so today is Teddy Bee's. Y'all know she's not open very often, so I stock up when she does open. She only opens every, like, three months. This was from the January pre-order, so there's a lot here. <clears throat> she tried to hide it from me, so she opened it when I was at work. She tried <laughs> it, to be sneaky. It got delivered while you were... I told you what I ordered. I know. Anyways, so it's a fairly big order. I did actually de-stash some stuff, and I still have a ton left. But this is the stuff I'm keeping, so he's just going to have to get over it. Um, She opens again end of april i believe she's doing a ready to ship next weekend the 16th and then she's going to do another pre-order a week or two after that so usually she opens january april july and october so join her group if you want to if you want to know all right so the sample i got is messy buns and ugg boots and i have no idea i know it's chai tea and something else you don't like, I that? like that oh you do Mm -hmm. Smell a little cinnamon in Yeah, chai tea has cinnamon in it. I actually like this. I'm thinking of, I didn't get it in this pre-order, so I'm thinking of grabbing a tub or a loaf in the um, ray of ship. So instead of doing chunk bags, she did chunk tubs. And they're the standard 8-ounce tubs like her chunk bags, but they're in these little plastic tubs. So I'm going to do those first. The first thing I have is abracadabra, which is pink sugar magic in the air. Let them eat abracadabra. cake. You know, it's too early in the morning for you to be. Yeah, it's not too early for me. Mmm, like that. It's yeah. like birthday cake. Gosh, you're weird. It's pink sugar, magic in the air, and let them eat cake. Pink what? sugar. What? Oh my lord. Y'all pray for me. <laughs> I have to deal with this every day. <laughs> Better than Benjamin. Yeah, well, we're not going to go there. Next is Christmas trees and cream and crushed candy cane. So it's a layered tub so the the top is the cr uh, crushed candy canes and the bottom is the christmas tree and cream mm. and i just think this is going to be so nice around christmas if i can get it out oh that's cool oh yeah and then the top is the mint so when you chop it ideally you would do all three layers it's two layers that's not necessarily the layer no that's just the topping the, oh. the design on the top um, so ideally you would chop it and then use a bottom layer and a top layer together. I think that's going to be so nice around Christmas. Oh, yeah. Minty and tree-like. <clears throat> All right. Next is Bum Bums on the Beach, which is apple-infused coconut water, tropical fruits, citrus, berries, tuberose, suntan lotion, warm driftwood, blended with creme de bum bum. Creme de bum bum. <laughs> All right, then. You, you probably won't like that. Yeah, I don't like that. Oh, you don't like coconut. Yeah, I can't smell coconut. Oh, okay. So if you can't smell it, it's okay. Mm -hmm. This next one, I'm not even going to let you smell because it's bakery. This is the one you didn't like. Ugh. Yeah. <laughs> Blackberry butter pecan. 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 <laughs> butter pecan waffles, blackberry jam, it's butter pecan. Pecan. It's pecan. No, it's pecan. <laughs> I love it. He hates it. So that'll be one I melt when he's at work. You'll be all right. No. You'll be all right. Here's another layered one. This one's going to be another uh -huh. really, no, another really good Christmas one. Winterfell Vanilla Balsam Magic in the Air. This one's actually triple layer. Really? Yeah. So there's a blue layer. Green layer. A green layer and a pink layer. But this oh. is, well. You need some help? No, I don't need any help. I got, I got this. Let me see it before you break the I've got it. Ooh, I like that. It's just like a lot of pine. Mmm. It's so pine. That smells like a uh, fire salt. Um, uh, the, uh, Winterfell has marshmallows, fireside, palo santo, white birch, icy snow, and vanilla. So, yes, it's th that's going to be amazing. Hey, y'all, I'm getting better at these notes on this. <laughs> I'm getting there. <laughs> Around Christmas. This was pretty, there was a lot of fresh scents, a lot of, Chris those are the only two I think I got that were like Christmassy. The next one is the Hamptons, which is watermelon, lemonade, salty Sierra, crisp linen. Mm. Yes. Mm. Yes. That's really nice. Her watermelon lemonade is really, really good. Mm. 
I was iffy about these tubs, but I think they're going to store really nicely in my drawer because you can stack them up. So shut up. I don't know what you're laughing about now. You get another house, you just got to get one room for just your, your, your wax melts. By the time we move, I probably won't be into wax melts anymore. Who knows what's going to happen in five years. You cannot laugh at this. Laid on the beach. <laughs> a blend of beach nights and boardwalk marshmallow clouds. You said not to, but I, and I did. I, okay. I know. <laughs> Any man, you tell, do not laugh at, at this, they're going to laugh. I love her beach nights. Um, her beach nights is one of my favorites. So I do have quite a bit here that has beach nights. Not quite a bit. I probably... Three, four total that have beach nights. All right, next is Winterfell. I actually got this by itself. Marshmallow Fireside, Palo Santo, White Birch, Icy Snow, and Vanilla. So does that, does that right there take a picture? It takes like a still photo of... Oh. Like a thumbnail? Yeah, so if you want to do a thumbnail. Which, doing thumbnails is a pain in the ass because you have to upload it on the actual website and not the app. So I don't do thumbnails anymore. I used to. Back when I had my shit together. <laughs> All right. The next one is Khaleesi, which is Palo Santo, Tonka Bean, Oud Wood, Warm Vanilla Sugar, and Fireside. Mm. Oh, fireside, y'all. Yeah, so you'll like that. Mm. Yes. And I do have oh, quite a bit of Palo Santo blends in here, too. What are you looking at? It's a free country. People can do what they want. I don't nobody outside. <laughs> it's like six in the morning, so. It's like windy. All right, the last of the chunky tubs is Soothe, which is sweet lavender, cotton, and cashmere with green, clo <laughs> clean green clove and aloe. That tripped me up. That was a tongue twister. It was. This is just so mm, nice. Like that. It smells like, uh, like the lotion you have in the room. It kind of it does, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. The peach or whatever it's called. Whatever the lotion is you have on your on your hood so on the headboard. I don't know. I don't know what I have in there. Okay, so that is box number one. So box number two has a couple souffles and the rest is loaves. I don't order a lot of souffles just because they're small. And most times I will buy a souffle if it's something I'm unsure about. But then nine times out of ten I'll go back and get something bigger. Um, so the first one I have is Cottontails, Juicy Hawaiian Punch, Blooded with Lavender, and Laundry. This one I was kind of unsure about with the Hawaiian Punch, but I do like it. Ooh, hold okay. up. Come back. Y'all can have that. <laughs> He's going to be sitting there sniffing. Right there. Sniffing the hold up. Hold up. <laughs> there it is. <laughs> mm. <laughs> Next is Milk of the Poppy, which is Palo Santo in the richest creamy vanilla. This one I was really unsure about. Okay, y'all can y'all can share it with me. Um, but I do like it. This is another one I'm gonna go back for when she does the radio ship. No, sir, you don't do it right. Ooh, yeah, it's, pa oh. it's Palo Santo. Palo Santo and vanilla. Nice. Yeah, so that one I was unsure about. Um. But yeah, that those two I'm gonna try to get a loaf in when I uh, when she does the um, the rate of ship. Her rate of ship is very cutthroat. I'm not really a fan of her rate of ship, so I try to stock up in the pre-order. But then I always smell things and go, oh no, I need that. So I am gonna try <laughs> to order um, a loaf in those couple. And the last of the souffles is vanilla mint snowflakes, which is sugar cookies, vanilla sugar. Sugar cane, peppermint, bergamot, jasmine, and citrus. So this is another one that's gonna be really good around winter, like Christmassy. You're not gonna like that. It's mint. Mm. I don't really smell vanilla. I smell vanilla. Oh, there's vanilla. And that is probably the only one I bought that I would be okay just keeping the souffle and not upgrading. All right, so last is the loaves. There's a lot of loaves. There's about 20 in there? No, there isn't. There's two, four, six. It's like 11. 11, wow. I ordered 12 and I sold one because I wasn't a fan. What was it? It was a strawberry cookie. Oh. It just smelled weird. I don't know. Anyways, all right, so the first one I have is Escobar, which is like everybody raves about this scent. It is Beach Nights and Palo Santo. I like this. This was a pretty heavy Palo Santo. Oh, there's a lot of Palo Santo in here. 
You know, I like a spark. Yeah, and Beach Nights. This is one that I would almost go in and get a backup loaf um, during the ready to ship, but I know it'll go quick, so I really don't want to be cart jacked of everything else. All right, the next one is Rainy Day, and this is Crisp Apples, Dewy Air, Fallen Leaves, Oak, A Touch of Lavender, and A Hint of Sandalwood. This was, there's a couple that I got that I'd never smelled before, and this was one of them. Mm. Yeah. I like, I like it. It's kind of rainy, kind of fruity. The fallen leaves kind of gives it a little bit of a... Kind of man, no. kind of manly type vibe. I don't know. This is another one that I... Fiji. Yeah, Fiji. I did not ever smell this one before. It is sea salt, driftwood, green clover, and aloe warm vanilla sugar. Driftwood. I like driftwood too. Mm. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. Why is it double? I don't know. She probably just actually had a second tin in there. All right, next. This one's a favorite of mine also. John Snow, and this one's Palo Santo Flannel Sheets, Creamy Vanilla, and Mint. What? I want to smell the, the, the flavor or the, the, the flavor. The wax, not the metal. <laughs> mm. <laughs> I don't know whose fault that is. This one you're not going to like, but it's one of my favorites. Sugarberry birthday cake. Strawberry pound cake, blueberry sugar, and birthday cake. Yeah, I'm keeping it away from me. There's a couple here that are bakery. And this one is good. Everybody that melts it loves it. What are you eating? I don't know what she knows. She's not eating anything. She's smelling. Oh. All right, the next one is Frosted Lemon Sugar Cookies, which is sweetened tart lemons blended with like lemon buttercream and Frosted Circus Sugar Cookies. Like yeah, because it's lemon. You like lemon. You don't have one that smells like the old lady pants. No, that's not this vendor. Okay. No offense to anybody that wears old lady pants. pants. <laughs> <laughs> All right, the next one is Frosted Mint Sugar Cookies, and I like this one, and you're not because it's mint. I know, you're staying far away from that. Oh, it's so good. Just like a minty sugar cookie. This one you like. Sundresses Ooh. and lemonade. Mm -hmm. Fresh ozone and air. Roses, jasmine, lavender, vanilla, melon, sugared lemon with a fizzy twist. A lemon, lemon, lemon. And melon and lemon. Get, get melon, it right. Lemon, <laughs> What? <laughs> okay, so you guys get the bag because he's confiscated that. If it was this, if this was edible, y'all, I'd be eating it. <laughs> Put it, up. it wouldn't probably it probably wouldn't uh, digest correctly. No, it wouldn't digest. Do you need help? Yes, apparently I can't. Put a loaf back in the bag. <laughs> <laughs> This pre-order had like all of my favorites and I was out of most of these, so I was super happy. Next is Surfside Sweet Shop, which is birthday cake, marshmallow cream, butter cookies, cake batter, and beach nights. This one is another top favorite of mine. He hates it, so I melt it when he's not home. I'm not even gonna let you smell it. I know, <laughs> The next one you're not gonna want either is strawberry pound cake Good. and pumpkin pecan waffles. All right, the next one's Pecan. the Queen's Dowry, which is strawberry pound cake, toasted marshmallows, and pecan waffles. Pecan. Yeah, yeah. And I have a, I had a souffle in this, and I melted that bitch really quickly. Oh, this is so good. No. <laughs> <Should wait for me. laughs> All right, and last but definitely not least. This is the, my favorite one. The Perfect Storm, Sea Spray, Ocean Water, Citrus, Damp Leaves, Dark Amber, and Oak Moss. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Mm. It kind of, this one reminds me of Black Sea. Mm -hmm. It's got that kind of vibe to it. All right, so that is everything. So once again, it was a decent haul. 
I didn't sell a ton. I sold a couple tubs. I sold one loaf and a few souffles that I had like duplicates of. Um, but otherwise, I feel like this is a good a good haul. I mean, it's good size, and I might order from the the ready to ship next week. It's going to depend on if I feel up to the Hunger Games of <laughs> how fast everything jumps out of your cart. Um, I should have a discount because she does um, points, and every purchase you make you get points per hmm. dollar. And so I should have um, a reward that I can About $800 with points. No, <laughs> no. <laughs> so, so anyways. Every time I turn around, there's a, a damn <coughs> wax can, uh, box on the, on the I hadn't, porch or an I envelope had, in the hey, damn. I hadn't bought for six months. So you just stop. He's so dramatic. Okay, so that's everything for this order. I will talk to y'all later. Thank you so much for watching. Bye, guys.